Hello everyone, my name is Robert Marzullo from Ram Studio Comics and welcome back. So in this lesson you'll learn how to digitally paint wood, fire, and ice inside of Adobe Photoshop. The reason why I think lessons and studies like this are so important is that if you just jump right in and try to create advanced paintings you'll start to get bogged down by the complexity of it and you'll forget certain steps. But the beauty of doing studies like these is you start to learn all the little nuances in the smaller sections of materials. Uh, like texturing the wood and creating soft and hard edge effects inside the flame or the ice cube and things like that. So once you start to understand more of that process, then when you go to create your cool fantasy art paintings, you can kind of pull from the things that you've learned from these smaller studies. So that's really the purpose of this particular lesson, is to show you step by step how I work through this and how things don't always start out perfect, but through modifications and edit of your work, you can get to a nice finished piece. So in this lesson, some of the features we'll be talking about are the selection tools, how to use the dodge and burn tools to punch up light source and shadow, and also how to use blending modes to enhance some of the effects of your digital paintwork. One of the things that makes painting in Photoshop so great is just the ability to edit the work as you go and just add more and more effects and kind of check your work with the layers. So I'll show you all that and I hope you're excited to learn this. It should be a fun and informative exercise for you. This is a 47 minute real time tutorial step by step and you also get the layered PSD file to study from as well as the custom brushes that I use to create this artwork. And keep in mind if you take any of my lessons or courses if you have any questions I'm here to help you with that. So I thank you very much for tuning in and watching this. Also let me know if you've got any ideas for future video topics that you'd like to see covered and I'll make sure to get that on the list. Good luck with your painting and thanks for stopping by.